What up, Anal Beads? <laughs> hey everyone, welcome to another passionate Kelsey vlog. That's it? Yeah. Should, should I do something else? <laughs> yeah, you're gonna have like an intro. That's my intro. Um. Right, I'm home. I'm here. I'm around. We just went out to lunch because we 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 needed some dog food. So we just stopped, got us some food, and then we stopped and got the dog some food, and then we came home. And now we need to get to work. Okay, there is some things that I just want to like quickly finish up. I feel like my desk area is just kind of a wreck. It's covered in stuff that I need to finish. So I want to finish things and get them out of the way and then I feel like I can truly start my day because there's just there's a lot going on over here and it's it's um it's it's doing it's doing a lot for me okay I think first I'm gonna finish this ear warmer because I cranked it out on my Centro the other night at like midnight just because I was looking for stuff to do I felt productive for some reason at midnight and I was like I am going to crank out and ear warmer, but no, I will not finish it. No, no, no. So yeah, I'm going to finish this ear warmer and get it up and listed on my website. It's so like bouncy. Oh no, Neji, I almost kicked you. Oh my god. I was like kicking the ball and at the same time Neji lunged for it, so I had to like divert my foot and I shoved my whole foot in his ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you kicked our dog. I don't come in here to give you content. I come here to live my life. Oh. You like me, don't you? Fuck no. <laughs> doing that. Stop doing that. Why? What is it? How is this gonna affect you later in your life? It just annoys me. So. <laughs> you know what else annoys me? Girls who run into houses with their cars. All right. You can stop bringing that up. What? The house will never forget. Actually, the house is fixed. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Right, right. 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 Done. On my website. Next item. I'm going to finish off this knitting machine beanie that I made before Christmas and uh, I just, I didn't finish it off. So I'm just gonna do that real quick. I could send him the kid named finger meme. What? Kid named finger meme? Uh-huh. <laughs> what? <laughs> Eyes closed, dick out. Oh, okay. That's how I play my video games. Finished up this hat. Okay, now I have these things that are sitting on my desk. This is a leftover yarn after making two of these knit beanies with it. So I'm gonna tie these together, I guess, and I'm gonna wind them up just to get them out of the way. I'm not exactly sure what I'm gonna do with the yarn, but I'll, I'll figure something out eventually, maybe. Probably not though. Okay, done. Now that my desk is a bit more cleared off, I want to pack up an order that we got today. Oh well, I get, I'm gonna say it was yesterday, but it says today because it was past midnight. But it was like 
12.05 or something. But I sold one of our pastel knit beanies that I put on my website from my last vlog. So let's pack this up. This hat is going to Jessica in Washington. Washington, wow, I can't speak. She gets a little thank you card, of course. There is still one more pastel knit beanie left. All right. There we go. Okay, now that I have got some things done, I feel much better. I am gonna go watch probably an episode of Echo, the new Marvel show, and I'm gonna be working on the uh, rainbow sneak peek top that I have in progress. We're gonna eat some of our little Japanese snack box. Oh, fuck yeah. Tayaki, yeah, that's good. Pretzels. Ah. Red bean donut, Neji, no. Mmm. Isn't that delicious? Yeah. Yeah. Caffey looking candy rope thing. That's pretty good. Mm. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> Fried potato snacks. Oh yeah. Holy dick. I like that they look like little french fries. Choco corn puff ta ta huh? Stick. Choco corn puff stick. Doesn't it taste like cocoa puffs for like a little bit, for like half a second? Yeah. Taro jerky. Jerky? Go ahead and try that and I'll let you know what type of meat it is. It's eel. It's eel jerky. Mm. Deep fried mochi. Mm. Mm -hmm. I like it. CC lemon. Obviously, I'm gonna fucking like this. Oh, this is good. Right? And then last, lucky red and white Kit Kats. Can you guess the flavor? Is it just regular Kit Kat? Is that your final answer? White chocolate. Okay, okay, so good. it's a regular Kit Kat with white chocolate. It's white chocolate and milk chocolate together! It's a regular Kit Kat. <laughs> you wanna give me a Baja Blast? Yeah. Then we can finish the snacky wackies. Nice! We have moved to the gaming room because it's time to play games. And this is how far I've got on the sneak peek tops. I'm gonna finish it up like real quick and then I haven't decided what I want to start next. If I want to make another top or another beanie. All right guys, look, we finished this top. I'm gonna lace it up and then we're gonna put it in my stock closet. I already restocked it on my website, so that's all good. And someone bought a beanie, so I want to pack that up. We sold this one which was the other hat that I made with double stranding retro stripes. Maybe I should make more of those right now because I sold both of them. Anyway, someone bought this, so we're gonna pack it up. This is for Susan in Topeka. Cool. That's two hats today. Fantastic. So I think that I'm gonna do just that. I'm, I'm gonna start knitting another hat. I would like the colors to line up more like the first time that I made the hat and not the second time that I made the hat. Cause they looked really different, you know? Maybe I should just look and see what colors were together. But it's weird that they look so different because I made them back to back. Also like, should I use this? How does this yarn even work? Oh God, there's a spider on it. There's a, there's a spider on that. There's a, there's a, there's a spider. Is it dead? It looks like it might be dead. <laughs> ah. 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 Okay. Yeah, I think it's dead. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I touched that. I touched that. This is why you, uh, this is why we need to cycle through our yarn stash more often because if, uh, 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 I feel, I feel it, I feel it, I feel it on me, I feel it on me. Because otherwise it accumulates spiders. Okay, well, it's gone. At least it was just right on the outside and it was dead. That's fine, right? <laughs> anyway, so I have this. 
I have this that I have wrapped, which was left over from the two hats that I had made. And I, I want to use it, obviously, but I'm like, okay, so it starts at yellow and then it goes to green and then it goes to blue, which would be like here, yellow, green, blue. And then after that, it would turn to, it should be going back to green and then it'll turn yellow and then it'll turn orange. Okay, I think that maybe I can tie the, t the center pieces together. The center of this ball is the yellow and the center of this one is the yellow. And then I think that, I think that will align. Oh well, I'm, just, I'm gonna tie this on here and then I'm gonna pull from the outside and it's gonna look, it's gonna look however it's gonna look, I guess. And then that's how it's gonna look. Okay, so we're gonna be starting. By the way, I posted a YouTube tutorial for this knit hat if you wanna know how I made it. We're gonna move back to our gaming. Attack rolls against you have disadvantage and you have advantage on dexterity saving throws. Anything to save yourself, you coward! Damn! This is how far I am on the hat. It's having like weird color change patterns because first of all, in one of the skeins, not the skein that I tied the extra yarn onto, but the other skein, it had two factory knots in it, okay? So the first factory knot was here, right? Where this kind of harsh-ish line is, and then the second factory knot was here. And then right up here where this line is, that is where that little cake ended that I had tied on. So I just finished the cake and started on the skein here. So it's it's like it's making stripes and uh, it usually doesn't have stripes whenever I use these yarns together. So it doesn't look bad. It's definitely interesting. But anyway, I'm going to take a break. I'm going to make some food and we're probably just gonna like watch TV for the rest of the night So I don't think I'm gonna finish this, but I might work on it here and there. We're making hamburger helper. I have yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm not talking to you <laughs> We have four cheese lasagna flavor. Oh, I need to preheat the oven because of course we're also going to have crescent rolls mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna turn on music and cook this so see you later we got our hamburger helper and we got our rolly rolls and I got a Dr. Pepper. Good night. Good morning. Have some Captain Crunch. First things first, I made a sale last night. We sold one of our Kansas City Chiefs ear warmers. So I'm going to package that to start my day. This is going to Jessica in Maryland. There we go, that's done. The next thing I wanna do is I wanna continue working on this knit hat that I started yesterday. I think I can finish it up pretty quickly, but definitely has an interesting look. From here on out, unless there are more factory knots in the skeins, which I don't think there is, then it's not gonna be striped anymore. So the bottom is gonna fold up, so. I finished the hat. Here's what it ended up looking like. So I'm going to slap on a uh, logo tag, take some pictures of it and put it up for sale on my website. Let's see what it looks like folded. Okay. Yeah. Whenever it's folded up, it, these like the middle kind of matches up and then the ends kind of match up with the green. So interesting. I need to buy more logo tags. I'm gonna keep making all these hats and ear warmers. Ta -da. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Uh, now I need a head. Look at this guy, look at this guy. Why is it always so hard to put a hat onto a mannequin head but not on your own head? All right, that looks good. Easy. So I'm going to edit all these pictures that I just took and put the hat up for sale on my website. If you're wondering, I use the app Photo Room on my phone. I pay for it, but you can also use the free version. I honestly just like it because 
it removes the backgrounds on photos automatically for you like this you know and it's really fast i think if you use the free version you have to like it'll put a photo room like watermark on it but it's just like in the top corner and you could crop it out <laughs> but i pay for it because i like using the batch feature where i can upload like 10 photos of the product and then it'll do all the photos at once then you can export them all at once i want to finish up this skein of the granny square yarn that i bought because i've just i've gone through about half of it i've made all of these granny squares and i just want to go through the rest of it finish up all the granny squares so many people that clicked on my review of this yarn they did not watch the whole video so i've seen quite a few people hating on the yarn in the comments but i just want to i want you to know that this yarn has grown on me like I will say it was hard to figure out in the beginning and I was frustrated, but now that I have it figured out, I like it. I like the yarn, okay? And I already bought more and it's on the way and it should be here tomorrow. So I'm just gonna be, I'm gonna be making, I have nine over here, so I should be able to make six more with this. So I'm just gonna, gonna do that. I made like five more granny squares and I got so sleepy, tired, I want to fall asleep. High drops? But my dad called me so we're gonna go out to dinner now. Okay, I'm home now. We went to this pizza place. <laughs> it was like one of those fancy pizza places that only serves flatbread and it's like oven baked and whatever, I don't know. It was good though. I got my regular, which is just pineapple pizza. Just pineapple, no ham. And now that I'm home, it's 7.30. I'm starting to get a bit of a headache, so I think I'm gonna take some ibuprofen. And then I, I'm, kinda, I'm kinda thinking that maybe I might just read a book for the rest of the night and kind of chill out. I know that's like no fun for you but it's gonna it's gonna be so fun for me so that's what i'll do i am on the last book in the percy jackson series the the for of the first five so i'm currently reading the last olympian and i'm about like i think i'm over halfway through so i'm getting eager to finish and i think i'll most likely continue reading on to the next series but maybe i'll take a break and read a different book in between Anyway, that's what's up. Uh, well, <laughs> I totally lied. I am not reading. I have been sitting here and just like knitting for like the past hour. So I had another hat that was on my needles and I was like, you know what? I'm, I think I just wanna like finish off this hat before I go and read because it was mostly done after I finished the first hat that we made with the rainbow yarn, I just ca I cast on another one, and so here it is. I finished it, but yeah, I was like this far, and I was like, all I have to do is like a couple more rows, and then I'll just close off the top, and then I'll, you know I'll like get it out of the way. And then, of course, after that, after I finished it, I was like, you know what? Why don't I just like cast on another hat and get it started, and now here i am still knitting that hat <laughs> it's because i i saw these two yarns sitting next to each other today and they have been sitting in my closet back there for a long time they've just been sitting next to each other and uh, like the cakes and i looked at them next to each other today and i was like maybe i could knit those together into a hat and so that's what I'm doing. That's what I've started at least. And it looks, it looks all right. It's pretty interesting. Um, you know, I think it's cool. There's a lot of different gray tones. This one is obviously just gray. And then this one is, there's a light gray, a dark gray, a cream color and a light cream color. I want to say white, but it's not really like white, white, so. But whenever I saw them sitting next to each other today, I was like, those have been there forever. 
and I've been making so many of the double stranded knit hats lately I was like I am just I'm gonna knit those together into a hat so I was like let's get it started and now I can't stop because I didn't want to get up and go grab my book and then like set it up or find a spot to sit to read but the main reason was that I wanted to get this hat started so I did and now I, I'm just I can't stop. I'm already knitting. I might as well just keep knitting, you know? I think this is a good, well, I don't know. It's not a change of pace per se because I, uh, I'm i still knitting the same hat, but it's a different color, so that's fun. I have only made a bunch of like lighter or bright colors, so yeah. I'm doing this one now. I've been wanting to do a solid color one, I was debating about whether I wanted to do these two colors together or two colors of solid together. But if I do a solid color one, I really want to do pink because this pink yarn that's behind me on my shelf has been like eyeing me down for a while. It's saying, make me into a hat, please. So that'll probably be the next one after I finish this. I don't know how much yarn I'm going to have left from these cakes. I hope it uses up a good amount. I either hope that it uses up a lot of it or I hope that there is enough to make another hat. Yeah, I just, I don't, I don't want leftovers, man. I don't want leftovers. I ate too much pizza. I'm trying not to fall asleep. I have actually just been sitting here with nothing on. <laughs> Quiet, just like staring at this. Hey, hi, hi, hey, hey. I did not finish this hat last night. I was so tired. I fell asleep, but here's what it's looking like. The colors are like kind of in an interesting layout. They're like, they've got some waves going. So it is so, so cold today. Right now it's snowing. Currently it is three degrees. I guess like at least it's not in the negatives, but I mean three is like, that's pretty cold, okay? My hair is all staticky every time I try to brush it and that makes me so angry. I, I hate that. I hate that so much. Every winter, every time it's freezing, my hair is always like a staticky mess and I just, I don't, I hate it. I don't know why. It's probably like science or something, but damn. It's annoying. <sighs> anyway, anyway, I'm not gonna finish this hat right now. This is not on my list of things to do. This is just a project that I have cast on that I can work on whenever I want, okay? We're, I'm not gonna do this right now. <laughs> what we're gonna do right now is a little bit of work and a little bit of fun. So I got an order last night for a rainbow bucket hat. So we gotta pack that up. This is for Nicole in Boston. I just uploaded a video where I tried to make as many bucket hats as I could in one day. I think that I didn't pick the best day for it because I had like a headache the whole time, but I ended up making five, so great. You should go watch that video if you haven't already. But yeah, somebody bought one of our rainbow bucket hats, so I'm going to pack it up. I have not cleaned up from making all those rainbow bucket hats. And then I also started making another one, which I should not have done because now I need to finish that before I can put away all the yarn. All right, okay. My scale is buried, it's buried. There we go. All right, now we're gonna have some of our fun and that's because I got this in the mail. I don't think this is my full order. We placed an order in my last vlog and it was, I think $115. I'm pretty sure this is only like half cause they didn't send it all at once. There's a bunch of paper in it. Ooh, okay, all right. I got some more of the Red Heart Granny All-in-One Square yarn. So I guess I got two of these, which is the color Soft White Pink Punch. Looks nice. 
So many people have been saying that all the colors on these are ugly. You guys are you guys are just, you guys are just wrong. Like not all the colors are like 100%, but they have a lot of really cute colorways, okay? This one reminds me of sweet tarts. Yeah. Yeah. That'll be really cute. The other color that I got, I got three of them. And this one is called Soft White Hot Stuff. Mm -hmm. I like this. I like this. It's a little bit darker than the other one, but still cute. It goes dark purple, light purple, dark pink, light pink. I don't know what I'm going to make with it yet. I really want to make a sweater with one of them. My other squares that I've already made in the first video, the review video, those are spoken for. I've decided to make a scarf with the light white gray cream color one. And then the other ones, I am going to be making a pair of pants. I've never made pants before and everybody's always asking me to make pants. So I'm going to do it, okay? Last bag. We've got four more of our beloved strawberry and cream. Nope. Lily Sugar and Cream Color Strawberry. There she is. You know what she looks like. And that's great because I only have one, two, three, four, five, six. I only have six of them. And I go through these babies so fast. Like this color, people order this color constantly. So that'll be gone. Let me just, let me, let's put it on the shelf, shall we? Okay, next we have a new yarn that I've never tried before and I bought it because I was excited about the colorway. So this is Big Twist Party in the color Bubblegum. Don't you just love how like nice and like mixed this colors are? I think I figured out why I like it. I love double stranding yarn, especially color changing yarn. Like whenever I was double stranding the Red Heart Retro Stripes or the Red Heart Baby Rainbow that we were doing to make those hats. I just love the way that like there's two colors together and then they those two yarns also change colors so then the whole project like changes colors in such a fun way and then also like I don't have to do any work for changing the colors like cutting the yarn tying on a new color planning I just like to let it you know work its magic and with yarns like this since all four of the little strands that are twisted together are different colors and they're changing throughout. It's basically like double stranding color changing yarn, but it's just one yarn, you know? Does that make sense? <laughs> anyway, I'm excited to use this. I'm not sure what I'm gonna use it for, but it feels really, really soft. It is softer than Red Heart Super Saver. Yeah, it's good. That's good, that's good. Mm. Yeah, I don't know what I can make. I need to just like make sure that I have enough yarn. So I'm excited to try it out. And that looks like that was everything in our little box. I believe I should have more Lily Sugar and Cream coming in the color Jules Ombre. And then I think that I have more of the Granny Square yarn coming as well. Just like one other color, but who knows when it's gonna get here. All of the packages have been like delayed because it's been so cold and it's been snowing on and off and stuff like that, so. What should we do now? Hmm? Sir Terry has got himself a winter sweater for cold outside. Okay, goodbye. Well guys, that is gonna be the end of this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. It is honestly too cold. I, my hands are too cold. I need to be on my couch wrapped in a blanket and watching a movie, so I'm not gonna do anything else today. <laughs> but thank you for being here, thank you for watching. Like this video if you liked it and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.